Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of Geometry Dash. Um, so we're back with Geometry Dash. I don't know if you can tell, but we're on Steam now. Yes, I do have Geometry Dash on Steam. And I did say in my vid that I would release, like, Geometry Dash videos like this month. But I, uh, I thought I could do it, but no. Uh, at least, that was only a couple weeks ago, so it's fine. It's just around that time. Anyway, we are on Geometry Dash. Um, let's check if we have any rewards. Let's see. Um, oh, okay. We have 5,000. I think we can buy something. And if not, then no oh well. But I'm pretty sure we can buy something, so let's go ahead. I'm right here. Yes, we can. Let's go ahead and buy this. And now we can go ahead and go to the icons and I believe that was it, right? I'm pretty sure it was. Looks cool. But um I'd rather use mine. Just has more detail. Anyway, um We are doing a hard demon and this is going to be a demon this is a demon I've been doing for a very long time as you can tell and it's more than this it's like around 3,000 attempts because I've done practice run I'm just going to show you what the demon is like I doubt we're going to get a new ice score because it's like nearly impossible for me and I'm using spacebar so you're probably gonna hear my clicks but I mean you could have already heard them on previous videos but it's gonna be pretty loud so sorry for the inconvenience this is called future funk I'm pretty sure you know where it is from Charles and GD and you might be wondering why haven't you done nine circles because everyone does nine circles I'm using future funk because I have more experience on it so um, we're gonna go ahead and do it by the way I'm not gonna be speaking much of the time because I usually concentrate on the solo a lot, so sorry if I don't really talk much. Wait, what? I pressed the damn spacebar! Uh, well, I want to get used to it, because I haven't done Future Funk in a while. So, um, let's go ahead and do one of the main obstacles in this level. Which is the dual wave. Once I get past the dual wave, I actually think like I could get a new ice score. I actually just beat the level. Actually, no, because dual. I can actually talk now because, you know, I'm doing a practice run. I did do a video previously. I don't know if you remember, but in the cup of video, I explained like that I made a, you know, Gentry Dash radio, but I didn't have any progress done. This is probably going to be the exact same thing, except I'm going to just show you guys what I'm doing. And the next Geontra Dash video on this is probably going to be me doing, you know, like high scores and stuff like that. But they're probably not going to have that much context, because it's quite hard for me to get a high score in a video, like an actual episode, so I'll just, just record it without context. So, um, yeah. I hate that damn part. It's not that I die. I I'm dying on it. Like I'm starting to die on it a lot. I don't understand why. It's such an easy part. It's just the duel and this part, and maybe the very ending and the ending. I don't know about the ending, the ending is pretty easy, but it's just those parts that are the main obstacles. Other than that, the rest of the level is quite easy. I'm probably never gonna play on Spacer, I just don't find it good for gameplay at all. Although I do find it good for spamming. What the hell is wrong with my spacebar? 
I swear to god I never die on these places and that's the problem with me in this level. I always die on the dumbest places. Like if I'm about to like have a high score, I die on the dumbest place ever. Like a place I've never died at and then it becomes the new place where I always die. You know, I, I used to always die at like that mini wave part. Which is why I call it an obstacle because I, I used to die a lot of times, now I don't but I still consider it an obstacle in this level. And there's just the smallest parts of the level where I always die on for some reason. You see what I mean? Dude, what the hell is wrong with that damn part? What is wrong with me in that damn part, man? What? By the way, I'm just planning to get past the duel so I can get used to it again. Dude, I literally fucking press spacebar. Dude, what the fuck is wrong with this damn level, man? Why is it that part where I die in? Dude, what the fuck is wrong with this damn game? I'm done. Dude, just let me pass that part. Just stop letting me fucking die there! What the fuck is wrong with that part, man? Dude, honestly, what is wrong? Forty-five to ninety. There, there you go, guys. Forty-five to ninety. Jeez, bro. It's that. It's the duel, man. I. Yeah. Let's get back to the main level.
Bro, I literally pressed on it. Dude, that's the fucking problem, man. Always this stupid fucking... I don't even know. The dash... The dash thing. It's this fucking thing, man. I hate it, man. It just glitches out and it doesn't unlock these damn spikes. Oh, uh, you know what? I needed to give some clarification. First of all, um, I don't even know if you guys can see my mouse, but anyway. And second, um, I'm using low detail because this my laptop came out, and I know this is a gaming laptop, but the fact that I'm recording and playing at the same time, it's not, it's not gonna buy it, man. It's not gonna do anything, okay? I already lag on Minecraft for some reason. Like, sometimes, not all the time, but sometimes, and it's it just not, it's not worth it. It's not, I'm not, it's not worth, um, putting high detail mode. I've already tried it. I can put high detail mode on some levels, but not this level. It's also that fucking orb, man. I hate that damn jump orb part. Dude, I literally pressed the damn space bar. I literally. Dude, this song is a fucking asshole sometimes, and when I mean sometimes, I mean all the time, dude. Getting to a high score on this level is near impossible. It takes me like three hours of, like, straight playing this level just to get, like, a high score that's less than 5%, and I'm not joking. I am not joking about that last part. 5%. And it's, last time was 69%, then it was 67, and then it was, I think it was like 57 or something like that. You know what I mean, dude. This, this, this level is just breaking me by the minute, man. No! What are you- Dude, it's always this fucking part! We're just not gonna talk about what the hell happened. That was once in a lifetime that I got that on video.
That is literally once in a lifetime. I literally had the chance to get a new ice score and I fucked it up because of that stupid part, man. I'm I'm actually just disappointed in myself, man. I am actually just a disappointment. That's the dumbest sh crap ever, man. It's always that stupid part, man, and I always die by going too high or too low. That's dumb, man. That's, that's... Yeah, I'm done, man. I, I, I can't. Wasn't even supposed to be high score, man, but like. This level is what's probably gonna be the main topic of the next four episodes of Geometry Dash, I'm assuming, because this level is just going to to probably break me man i'm gonna probably do this starting now from like every two videos i do so then a video will come out come out later no the next video i come out won't be related to this but then the video after that will be this so i don't forget again and i'll probably do it like i'll probably record like um probably record like pretty early so i can actually get my knowledge of this level because last time i played giant Judish, i was not playing this level for a long time yes i died at 69 haha funny number but what's even worse is that was literally right next to my high score i was going to get it but i could but hopefully you guys um enjoy this video 
if you did make sure to like and subscribe i guess i don't know just like anyways thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys next time bye bye